I'm too used to games not loading, like not having loading screens. I was expecting to open the doors and just be like out in the world. Mrs. Reed? Oh, Adam, I'm sorry you startled me. And please, call me Cassandra. You and Megan were together long enough. I was waiting for you. Out here? Why not come meet me inside? I don't know. I guess I'm just not ready. This is where you work, but to me, this is also the place where I lost my daughter. Yeah, that's kind of fair. Detached, sympathetic. I know what you mean. It's never been the same for me either. I guess it's not meant to be easy. It seems there's just no right way to deal with something like this. And I can't even begin to imagine how things have been for you after all you've been through. Yeah. A lot of things changed six months ago. I can't get over how much they've changed you. <laughs> At first, I couldn't even believe you were still alive. How do you handle all of this? Um... They did what they had to do to save me. That's... They did what they had to do to save me. And in a way, I can do more now than I ever could. I'm glad to know you take it so well. Many of us wouldn't be able to cope so easily with such traumatic changes. Can I ask why you wanted to see me? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. I'm here about Megan. About what happened to her. Or rather, about the investigation into what happened. What about it? Well, simply put... I feel something is not quite right with the way the case was handled. You think hmm. there was some foul play involved? I really? Do. Call it mother's intuition. But when speaking to some of the investigators, there were a lot of inconsistencies. And then I met this detective, a man called Chase. He agreed things weren't handled by the book, although he has no proof. And now you want to find out more? I'll never hear my daughter laugh again, Adam. I'll never get a call from her to ask how I've been or have the chance to ask her about her day. She was stolen from me. However unjustified this all is, I still want to know why it happened. I can see why she loved you. Not even that degree of mechanical modification could change what she saw in you. Hmm. Please, <laughs> will you help me find out what really mechanical happened Mechanical modification. Yeah, of course. Uh, wow, I'm not going to do that. I never got a chance to investigate the attack myself. I'll look into it. Thank you. This means the world to me, Adam, really. The first thing I'll need to do is meet with this detective, Chase. Good. He works part-time as a security guard in an apartment building on Brooklyn Court. I'll I wonder if it's the same place that I have to go for... Why does a detective need to work part-time as a security guard? Oh, he retired soon after the case. I don't really know the details. Interesting. Maybe he'll tell you more. I'm on it. Okay. Um. I feel like this app really doesn't want to move. Okay, uh, let's bring you up. I mean, let's just follow the arrows, I guess. Oh, before I forget, do I have more? I do. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, let's see. Um... Social enhancer. Cool. Okay. And then stealth. Oh, wait, what? Stealth enhancer, hacking, hacking analyze add on, capture, fortify, info link, radar, smart vision. What's smart vision? You through walls. Oh, shit. That's cool. Oh, ooh, I remember the Icarus. The Icarus is really cool. It's a reflex booster. Take down multiple opponents. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Dermal armor, cloaking system. 
Ooh, I'm a big fan. Okay. All right. It looks like I don't have any. I don't have enough points to activate anything, anyways. So let's uh, let's just keep going. We're going up here. the fuck are you? I ain't got nothing for you. Check with the man. And keep your hands where I can see them. You got anything you want to buy or sell? I'm the guy you want to deal with. I got booze. Everything's on the computer, right at your fingertips. How about booze? Will you buy my booze? Nope. You will. Oh, wait. Yes, you will. Oh, also buy my whiskey. Oh, look at you. Image upgrade, eh? Trank rifle, shotgun, mine template. Oh, I remember that. Yeah, you have to make your mines. Automatic unlocking device. Ooh, that could come in handy. The burst round system. Um, okay, it's for the shotgun. Okay, and what's this one for? Shot clock damage upgrade kit improves damage of standard weapon. Oh, oh, I think this is for anything. I. Oh, not enough room. Always a pleasure. God damn it. Um. I'm kind of tempted to sell the machine pistol. Oh my god. I have a whole box of these fucking things. Alright, yeah, let's sell the machine pistol. Oh, we'll sell the revolver ammo. I don't even have one. What'll it be? That's what we'll sell. There we go. And then I should be able to buy. Yeah. See you soon. Perfect. And then can I? Where is it? Yeah. Fine. Now the question becomes, do I want to do the pistol or do I want to do the combat rifle? That's the real question. Oh, combat rifle, I think. Yeah. Ooh, up the ante. I actually really like the pistol in this game. I'll come back and see you again. Okay, that's the limb clinic. Feel like I missed. Oh, wait, hold on. Back here. I uh, I didn't keep going. Fuck, not that way. Yeah, here we go. Grayson hooked me up with some real tight merch. Those odd lovers get in my face now. I'm ready to pop. Grayson, where he had you been? Yo, where you been, man? You be running shit through that abandoned gas station. You ready? You ready to pop him, eh? Word, I wanted to get some motherfucker. My Zenith ten mil. He can hook you up nice, man. If you go, tell him I sent you. Hey, whoa, easy, buddy. Put that thing away. Whoops. Hello there. <laughs> well, you must be Adam Jensen. <laughs> don't oh, don't mind me. I'm pointing a gun in your Reed face. Told me you might pay me a visit. <laughs> and don't take this the wrong way, but you're kind of hard to miss. I'll try to take that as a compliment. She told me you might have information regarding Megan Reed's case and the attack on Seraph headquarters. Oh boy, what a mess. Total pissing match. We had the feds on our ass, orders from three different departments, and pressure from so many lobbyists it felt like being the scrawny new kid in the prison shower. It is a oh, very high-profile case. Mrs. Reed said you thought some procedures were overlooked. You got that right. I mean, 
You know how it is. Mrs. Reed told me you used to be a cop. There's always cases where you see the lazy officers taking shortcuts. But this, this was different. Different how? Too much stuff got overlooked. People seemed way too eager to jump to conclusions. And every time I was remotely insistent, I got turned down by ranking officers. People wanted to bury this thing fast. Interesting. And that's never a good sign. Surely you have something more substantial than this. Yeah, well, that's where you come in. I got a couple of leads I could never fully investigate. I started poking around, but these government-type agents just gave me the creeps. I, I got scared. Months away from retirement, I didn't want to fuck things up. But <laughs> you? You obviously have the means to get to the bottom of this. So what have you got? First off, there's a rumor that the order to close the investigation came from higher up. Maybe even outside the local department. Anything like that would have passed through Captain Penn. There might be traces of this left on his office computer. Guess I'll have to pay a visit to the local precinct. Well, yeah, well, while you're there, there was an officer assigned to the case, Chet Wagner. He's not what you call a choir boy. And when he suddenly got brought on the case, I got suspicious. Somebody wanted him there. And I'm pretty sure he tampered with some of the evidence. Oh, shit. You should talk to him. Find out what he knows. Okay, I'll have a little chat with Officer Wagner. You'll most likely find him in the lobby. He got retrograded from his conduct, and he takes depositions now. <laughs> He won't budge easily, but I'm pretty sure you can find some dirt on him on his desktop. Oh. His office is on the third floor. You might find something there to help loosen up his tongue. Anything else worth looking into? Yeah. When the order came down to close the case, the bulk of the evidence was stashed in a storage locker. Maybe you can find some interesting stuff in there. It's on the alley right next to the station. The code is 40... 4891. <laughs> but I know an outside agency had access to that locker, so be careful. Thanks for the heads up. Bah, it's, it's nothing. And, uh, oh, uh, please, don't bother coming back here with details. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to help. But the less I know about this case, the better I'll feel. Hmm. How did you get assigned to this case? I didn't push for it, if that's what you mean. To be honest, I didn't want to get involved. Why not? I was an honest cop, Jensen. I always tried to conduct myself in accordance with the law, with procedures, and what I believed was right. Not really the standard M.O. for a case like this. Hmm. That's kind of true. You said an outside agency may have tampered with a storage locker. What did you mean by that? Well, I've seen, uh, I mean, I've heard that government agents may have locked up some of the more sensitive evidence in a safe inside the locker come on chase what are you not telling me damn it okay listen i snooped around that locker before and found the safe code but huh. i kind of got caught by one of those guys he knows i know jensen if i give you the code they'll know i talked shit call me negative but i can't think of a nice outcome to that Why retire from the force only to become a security guard? I mean, it looks like you still love the work. I love the idea of being a cop. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted to join the force. But I just got fed up. It's not like I had imagined it. It's a job. Some people are good at it, while others just don't care. And it shows. This case, the Seraph case, it was just the last drop in a cup already full. All right. That's all I need for now. I wonder if this is the apartment building I need to be in. Oops. Hmm. Let's put the gun away. Attack it. Crap. Oh, I got it. 
right. Can I rob anything in the kitchen? No. Ooh, hello. All right, I'll check that out in a sec. What I meant to do. Okay, there's nothing else in here. Capture software rating too low to hack device. Damn. All right. Mm. this turret dominant oh no all right level two okay i gotta get to here Nice. Okay, that was worth it. Rob that guy's blind. Oh, probably close your door. I was kind of expecting this to be like a rooftop, though. Can't go out there, right? No. That's how I was thinking maybe that's how I had to get to the other apartment building. Is it in the corner? Cyber pod, cyber fangs and shit. Throw him in the ring. Look at you, no. man. Another yeah, sucker who bought a bunch of shit you never really need. What do you call that? Great hmm. Ah. Uh. Damn, Ogs. Those power hungry bastards. Every last one of them. Go fuck yourself. I'm just guessing this is where I have to go. Okay, don't fall off the roof. Don't fall off the roof. Hmm. I didn't miss like an apartment door or anything, right? All right. Somebody's house. Okay. Oof. All right, we're going to do this. We're going to do this. Oh. I almost screwed that up. I couldn't get to the uh, stop worm properly. Hmm. Ooh, computer. All right, let's look around for... Uh, around for a password. G bar and kind of energy bars I got.
All right, let's try hacking it. Security one, okay. Access granted. Uh, broke it. Uh, if you finally move in, they broke any of your stuff. Let me know when you hook up your internet. I'll come and give you a hand with everything. Oh, well, I feel like I broke into this guy's computer for no reason. <laughs> Just because I could. I, I broke into this guy's place for zero reason. <laughs> I'm just an asshole. At this point, I'm a home invader. I had no reason to open, to go into that guy's house. Whoa! What? Wait, what? <laughs> How do people get into this fucking building? There's no there's no ground floor? What the hell? Did I miss a turn? I think I missed a turn. Okay. Huh. Yeah, that's that's it. Ah. Oh, not what I meant to do. Guess what? Time for a power bar. What the hell? Do they not do anything? Replenish every... Replenish a single cell... Oh, it's an energy cell. Not health. <laughs> Never mind. I didn't realize. Do I have anything for health? Two energy cells. Okay, so I don't have anything for health. Oh, fuck. Jesus fucking Christ, I picked a fight with a lot of people. Um, alright. So, it's good to know. Everybody on the streets are armed. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs>